dream is always the same. The story takes place in 2065 and Earth has changed because a meteor has crashed unleashing these alien creatures which literally suck the spiritual life out of you and the survivors have had to build these barrier cities to protect themselves from the phantoms and leading the fight against them is Dr. Aki Ross who is a fiercely intelligent and very determined young woman who is herself infected by one of the phantoms and so is on a sort of timeline to save herself and to find an answer to save her planet. The shield is powered and ready. Where are you going? To the cockpit. The ship is set on autopilot. We're in countdown to lift off. No, wait, it's too dangerous. Aki! I don't think we have to worry about, you know, these type of animations replacing human beings, you know. We're always going to need to see a, a Tom Cruise uh, moving around and shaking his thing. I feel like I've done my part and I've used my imagination and created a character, but then when all this other element is brought into it, the music, the sound, the, the pictures, these images that are drawn, uh, it's always magical to me because it's, it's beyond my imagination of what can be achieved. Here they come. But the others, Dr. Sid! Deep eyes will take care of them, come on! I really appreciated their sense of sharing, you know, and they were having such a great time making this. And they were at, at it for, what, four years? I just came in like two years ago. So to keep that enthusiasm and the anticipation up, the excitement through all these years, and, I, and they're still excited now, you know, it's, that doesn't always happen. Something's not right! It shouldn't be happening! Something's attracting them! I've never done anything like this before, and that was interesting. I didn't know how to do it. But it isn't a voiceover because you've got a, a body going to be put on there. So it is a body. It has a reality. So I gather this will be somewhat of a rough ride. Doc, you've got a talent for understatement. My wife and I sat in an empty theater watching it so that I'd know a little bit about what to talk about here. And it took my breath away. It's inhabited my mind for the last two days. Yeah. It's inhabited my imagination. It's like it was, uh, it was wizard wonderful. It is not a fairy tale, it is truth.